delegates from each country are here around the clock debating important issues. The World Alliance runs on a council system, so they aren't allowed to do anything without discussing it first. Yes, I know. I think we already talked. Are you still working on this? Really? Still? Hmm. This is a tricky one. Actually, I'm pretty busy. Can you leave me alone? Fine. Please wait a minute. The Alliance is holding an emergency session to discuss what to do about Deals World. Of course, I would start that right now. Well, Deals World just kidnapped Lilia, so it's probably Karg's first priority since the world revolves around Lilia and Lilia can do nothing wrong. They ask that you attend, Karg. Now they give a shit about my opinion. Really? What? <laughs> yes, Maru, you are speaking truth. Earlier they said we had to bring him a letter. Make up your fucking mind. Oh, Savina, she got my back. Savina, you want my dick, don't you? I bet you do. Don't worry, cog. You go ahead and leave the rest to me. Okay, I don't know about all that. I mean, I think we can trust her. She does enjoy me a lot. I think she got a little crush on the on the cargster. I'm like 17 though, so lady, you're you're like my mom's age. But Savina, the members of the alliance have never experienced war firsthand. They don't know how to react in a crisis. You'd be wasting your time if you stayed here. Yeah, she's probably right. Because these guys are fucking idiots. I'd rather that you tried to put a stop to Darkham and his evil plans. Okay. No pressure on the 17 year old little boy. Okay, I'm a commander. But seriously, and like a 10 year old companion and a girl. We're gonna go stop an entire army. It makes me feel terrible to have to ask you to do it though. It should. I'm a child. It's okay. I would have done it anyway. True. Thank you. Oh, and one thing I forgot to mention. When you won't get to Apistia, seek out a veteran named called Spencer. Spencer? I don't remember Spencer. Yes. He used to hold the rank of general in Apistia. So Spencer might not be very sexy if I don't remember what he looks like. He was retired. But when the Dillswald army invaded, he came back into service. He might be sexy, I don't know. He just might not be important. Now he's organizing the resistance. Um, where in Apistia? Probably in the capital, Sulphus. He might be hard to find though. The resistance has to operate underground. But he knows Apistia like the back of his hand. And you'll need someone with a good grasp on the war situation. I'm excited to go to another new place. Car, could you sound any less, like, grateful? Okay. I cool beans. From now on, we're going to need the leadership of someone brave and capable like you. I know, I'm fucking awesome. I pray for your good fortune and bad in You wanna... You wanna suck me off before I go? Could really use it. Paulette's such a bitch. She doesn't even like... She doesn't even swallow. I'm starting to realize I like linear games more than open world games in a lot of ways. I love the idea of open world games, but finding your way around in them is very hard. And finding your way around in a, in a linear game is very easy. <laughs> I forgot your voice, Gons. It's been forever. You're back at last. Gons has the big owl. Don't worry. It's ready to go. Great, thanks. We have to go to a pastia now. And I was wondering if maybe you would come with. He's not gonna come with us, cause, cause this is where he wanted to get off. <laughs> In that case, maybe he is gonna come with us. This is where he's gonna get off. But no, he's not gonna come with us. He doesn't like us. Wait, save it for later. Why, what's up? I might be getting some info on that friend I've been looking for. He's, oh man, he's dead, gone. Dark killed him. I killed him. In cold blood. There's a guy who's in the same unit. Apparently he's at the arena. Oh no. You don't want to learn. You don't want to learn what happened to him. He was killed by a 
Deimos by Dork. His poor boyfriend. Man, I feel so bad ruining that relationship. In that case, I'll go there too. And when we're done there, I'll tell you what I was going to say. Let's go. Well, we already know what you were going to say. It's pretty obvious. He's been acting a little bit strange lately. I wonder what's up. I think he wants to talk to you. Yeah. Oh, really? What do you want to say? Come on, tell me. Or, uh, hang on a second. I need to get my thoughts together first. Get myself ready for a thump, probably. Don't be a bitch! Why are you being a bitch? She said she was going to become a Oh, oh. Never mind. I already remember. Wait. Um, actually, I got something to say. You said I'm becoming a wrestler, and that's not really my kind of thing. This guy's such a douchebag, I remember now. I don't think it's a very good situation for either of us to be in. I forget stuff, because not only not only because it takes time in between episodes, but also because it takes time in between chapters. Like, you go to an entirely different world and character. Man, I hate this bastard. Just break, you know, break. Well, break. Break his fucking jaw. What are you mumbling about? Be a man, out with it. I... I think it's really important that we understand each other, so I'm gonna become a wrestler too, eh? Shut up! No! What the fuck? Really? I've been hoping you'd say that! I'll help you with your training! You won't know what hit ya! <laughs> I bet you won't. Oh no, why is it turning out like this? Cause you're a fucking bitch. If you wanna break up, just fucking break up. If she breaks your jaw, I guess it'll heal. Huh? What do you want? Well, it's not really what I want. It's about Gonza's boyfriend. I think he was killed by someone. I think he was killed by me. I'm looking for a soldier I know. He's called Rapier. Are you the guys that were in his unit? Rapier's dead. He was killed by Dark. I forgot your voice already. I just gave it to you. Rapier. He died a while back. Oh no! Gons his face! My child! What? Yeah, he was killed by some Deimos near Orkoth. Now you're gonna hate Deimos. Even more than you probably already do. By the Deimos. What in places was he doing in Orkoth? I don't really remember. I just know I killed him. He was a mercenary like us. We go there we're we go where we're ordered. A mercenary? I thought he was a rich old soldier. You don't know? All the countries in Adenade have been overthrown by Deimos. Damn, this is a dark day for Gons. Shit. Wow, you gotta feel really bad for Gons. Cause he just moved out into the forest to live by himself and he could have been protecting like the people he loved, but they all died. His boyfriend died because he wasn't there. If he was there, he would have just died too, because Dark is way stronger than Gons, and I would have destroyed him. Sorry, Gons. He was different from us. He didn't care about the money. We know, he was a good guy. Yeah. He'd come out with some idealist stuff about how there are other things that need protected, not just our own country. Tell me which one of the Deimos killed him. Well, it was an... It was a Deimos wannabe. Deimos human breed. Karg's brother. Ask Karg. It was the Orkon. It's their territory around there. Technically... Dark is half, uh... What's it called? Technically, Dark is not Orkon. He's not, he's not part of Orkon. Even though he runs Orkon now, he's not half Orkon. He's half whatever the hell his dad is. And Karg's dad, for that matter. Karg is also half Deimos. I cannot wait for that moment when he realizes he's half Deimos. Because right now, he still doesn't know. The Orkon. They won't get away with this. Everybody's got such a vendetta. Look, it's your boyfriend. I know. I'm sorry. It sucks. We all just need to get along. You're going to get revenge. 
Like, you're one to talk, Paulette. I know how you feel. Oh, okay. You're gonna relate this to your situation? You probably should, cause... But if you go off alone, now, to Orkoth, you'll just get killed. What would be the point? Oh, burn! Shit! Did Paulette just call Gons weak? Oh, you little bitch. You can't take all the orc on alone. You're not cool like me. I will get my revenge for my dad, but you, you are pathetic. It might be what you feel you should do now, but is it really a good idea? Huh, Paulette's speaking some facts right now. I think the time will come when we'll have to fight, but it's not now. That's true. I mean, there is going to be like a war. And you guys are going to come out on top because I'm picking Karg's side this time. This will be the first time ever. Karg, do you have it in you to destroy all the demos? No! What the fuck? That was never Karg's goal, was it? He just nods. Yeah, I do. <laughs> that means you got to kill yourself. If they're trying to destroy humans, then yes. So no, he doesn't, because not all Deimos are evil. We must defend ourselves from the Deimos. I guess that's how Rapier felt too. Yeah, I mean, he didn't really have a choice. So Gons is going to join our team. I forgot how or why, because I remembered him saying he didn't want to be on our team. Even though it wasn't directly his responsibility, he was trying to protect the human world. And all the time I was just, yeah, just being a loner in a forest, doing nothing to help anyone but yourself. But it's okay, I mean, I can respect that. You just needed away from it. Cog, I've decided to go with you. Just like Paulette said, I'll wait for the right time to fight. Yes! Even though you're not really the biggest asset to our team, you're actually the weakest person on our entire team. Gons! We're heading for a peace deal, right? Are we ready to go? Yeah, we're ready. Right then, let's get going. Big Owl is at the coast to the east of Cthulhu. It should be easy enough to find once you get out of town. Gotcha. Okay. Good old Karg with his cliche catchphrase. Okay. Next stop, Solfus, capital of a paste deer. Let's go. Goodbye, old man. I suggest you kill your wife. She seems to be a stalker, and she doesn't let you have any fun, so you should probably just smother her in her sleep. Goodbye, you guys. Man up. Grow a pair. Tell her you don't want to be a wrestler. Punch him in the nuts. Maybe one day you'll grow up and actually own a shop, not just stand outside of a shop. Your prices are fucking ridiculous. I think we get caught on the highway. I don't remember. I remember a highway scene where there was like soldiers. Yeah. Probably this scene. If I had to guess. I see a highway and soldiers. This is bad. It's a Dillswald Army checkpoint. Yeah, I remember. Damn Dillsweld. Should we bust through? I like your idea, Maru. If we cause trouble here, we'll have problems when we get to Solfus. Paulette, you're not wrong. But I still like Maru's idea. Well, what do we do then? They might know about us already. Hmm. We lie. What about just answering their questions? I guess. Of course, we'll have to think carefully about how we answer. Yes, we'll have to lie. But I carried out checks like these when I was in the mercenary, and it's hard to doubt people if they're up front. You're right. Anyway, we have to go this way to get to Sulphur, so let's give it a try. That's all we can do. I'm going to lie straight to your face. Is that okay? A beast is under occupation by the Dealsworth Empire. If you must pass through, then you'll have to be questioned by the god inside. I will pass your test. I basically, I mean, just lie for the most part. Entry into Capital Sulfus is generally forbidden. You can only come in if you've been questioned and received personal inf permission from the god inside. Damn, a Pistia is fucking hardcore. What the hell's so awesome about a Pistia? Let's talk to you. Are you gonna tell me the same crap? Get out! 
Not a lot here, but the deals well troops. Fuck yourself. I don't care who you are or where you're from. Don't think you could get past us. Even a mouse couldn't get by if it didn't have permission. Look, you guys, a mouse! It's getting through! I swear! Fine. They did not fall for my wily tricks. Okay, ask me your questions, amigo. Your destination, Solfus. Apicia is, the, is under occupation by the Dillswald army. You cannot proceed any further without our permission. If you wish to proceed, you must answer our questions. I thought that's what I was already doing. Where have you come from? Ragnoth, Aldro, or Adenade? I forget. It's Aldro, ain't it? Should we be honest? I'm from Aldro. Aldro. Home of the useless Royal Alliance, right? It will soon become part of our empire like all the others. Jesus Christ, you have no chill. You don't even... He didn't even, like, try and act like they aren't trying to take over the fucking world. Who are you? Uh... I'm gonna go with... I don't know. I'm gonna go with entertainers. We just look like an entertaining bunch. Like, mercenaries, yeah. Gons and Karg kinda can fit that, but... But Maru and Paula don't look like mercenaries. Traitors, none of us look like traitors. I'm gonna say we're entertainers. Entertainers! Yeah, look at us. We got a little boy with a fucking monster mask and a bow and arrow. You must be members of the troop that take what they asked for. Of course! <laughs> Burn! No wonder you all look so gaudy. But there doesn't seem to be many women in your group. What are you talking about? There's two women in our group. Look! Gons, look at them tits! Don's got some nice ass fucking tits. His tits are bigger than Paulette's. Her tits. Gon's is Gon's Gon's doesn't identify as a gender. And he does have, he had a boyfriend before his boyfriend died. Poor Gon's. And Maru's a kid. You can't tell if he's a girl because he's got long hair. And he doesn't have a shirt on, but but girls that are young don't have tits. So you can't prove anything. The occupying forces are all men. I don't think they'll get very excited over a bunch of guys. Damn. This is... That's fucking sexual. You want them to get fucking... You want them to bust our nuts all over our entertainers? Is that what you want? Because... I think we can do that. You've never seen Gons in his thong, have you? I think he can get them to bust their nuts. Right, next question. I want to make sure you're the kind of people who cooperate with the Dillswald Empire. Oh, we love the Dillswald Empire. I forgot my Dillswald Empire rules shirt, but I have one. If you are, then you'll know the names of the people on the army's blacklist. Give me a name. Oh, shit. Huh. The Lightstone Girl Lilia. No. No, we do not bring up Lilia. Why would we know Lilia, and why would she be on a blacklist? Because they own her. I'm gonna guess it's Spencer, because isn't he who we're coming to see? So he must not be good. I don't know about Samson. He doesn't, I mean, he doesn't really seem to have any connection to the Dillsweld. He's a bad guy, but he's doing his own thing, you know. I'm gonna go with this guy. Spencer. That's right. Yeah, the resistance. I thought he was the like we're coming to see him for a reason because we're against Dillsweld, so he's he must be bad to them. He formed the resistance and he's still opposing our army. God damn Spencer, I fucking hate that douche. We haven't found him yet, but when we do he'll be executed. Oh, I will help you find him, kind sir. That's the end of the questions. I think we passed it pretty easy. You don't seem to have anything to hide. I really don't. This is exactly all true. Permission to proceed. Gons, you better get that thong out. Hold it. What? There's one nice important thing I forgot to check. It's quite simple. 
To show your respect, I must ask you to utter the full name of His Majesty, the Emperor of Dillsworld. Fuck off, what? What? Dark? I don't... What? Darkham Int Wreath Orbin Dunn? Darkham Ekind... Ekid Nabard? Infoteg? What the fuck kind of crap is this? This seems like a name. Yes! Fuck yes! <laughs> yeah. That's right, please proceed. Yes. I know his full name, so I am obviously his friend. The fuck? Why did they- <laughs> They walked like three feet away from him and start talking like, Whoa, we got away with that! What the fuck? You guys are- Oh my god, video game logic. Phew, that was close. Great job, Karg! They're acting like they own the place already. How about we walk a few more feet? Just look at them. We can't let them get away with this. You're British, Karg. You're getting their accent. Oh, this town is not pretty. I was expecting something pretty. This is something from Final Fantasy 7? 8? I'm trying to think. The specific town. I think it's in... Oh. Right. Everyone assembled. Let's march to Kasim Highway to receive the guards. Retrieve the guards. Keep in information. Okay, bye guys. For the entertainment. Be prepared to jizz all over yourselves whenever Gons gets into his thong. He's got some nipple clamps he's gonna clamp on. He's gonna clamp one onto his dick and you guys can pull him around. Does it look like we can get away with much here? Then let's hunt out ex-General Spencer right away. But I doubt many people would know the whereabouts of the resistance leader. Even if there was someone that knew, I doubt they would just tell us like that. Yeah, we'll probably have to answer a bunch of questions, right? Well, let's just try to get as much information on him as we can. How much are you worth? Our aid group makes no distinctions between Dillsworld soldiers and resistance members. It's my duty to heal tired and injured people no matter who they are. Damn! Oh, I thought she was... I thought she was asking for th $3. I was like, that's good. But no, she's she's asking for 60 bucks. Jesus Christ, she's worse than in Kathena. Never mind, bitch. She must have upped her prices because there's soldiers here and she knew that they would be, like, injured a lot. That's my logic behind why. <sighs> Presently, all economic activities in Sulphus are under the control of the Dillsweld army. If you want any goods, you must wait for your rations. Who knows when that'll be, though. Fuck yourself with a dildo. Not a small dildo. A giant metal dildo. I've already explained, but you just don't seem to understand. How could we possibly have anything to spare? All our supplies go straight to you. This girl is a liar. I don't remember why, but I think she's in the, she's in the cahoots with with me, so that's good. Don't lie. We've heard rumors that your husband Jakal is selling goods to the resistance on the black market. Just tell me where he is so I can rate that sexy ass of his. Then we can interrogate him. I mean, what can I say? I have no idea where he is. In that case, we'll wait. I will stand right here until he gets back, bitch. But I don't know when he'll be coming back. No matter. Great. You just gonna stand here forever? Can we talk? What do you want? This shop's now under the control of the Dillswald army. Trading with civilians is forbidden. But I have food. I'm terribly sorry, but I can't sell anything to you now. I think Jockeys is our in inside man. 